everybody out there and welcome back to the second video on PSP Homebrew brought to you by www.pandorasales.com In the first video we showed you how to install custom firmware onto your PSP In this video we'll be showing you all the benefits and all the really cool stuff that you can do once you've got this custom firmware So what are some of the cool things that you can get on your PSP after you've uh, got your custom firmware? Well there's several things you can do You've got, you've got all your old school games like PS1 uh, Nintendo 64, even your Game Boy Advance. Um, you've got your ISO games, so you can back up your games onto your memory stick to make them load faster. You've got some, a lot of apps that you can download off certain homebrew sites, but one, what I'll be showing you a couple today, PSP Tube and PSP Maps, I think they make the PSP eBay as well. And there's just a whole bunch of stuff. I'll be just be showing you the brink of what you can do on your PSP. So without any further ado, I'll show you the full potential of your PSP.
course all this stuff can be done on your custom firmware PSP. Don't think that PandoraSales.com only sells Pandora batteries and magic memory sticks. They also sell a lot of other cool stuff. Like I got the skin for my PSP just a couple of weeks ago. And they've just got a really ton of cool stuff, so check it out. Alright, this is Tommy K. Thanks for watching. See you next time.